Backstage at Redden Leeds 2018. Young blood, my friend, how are you? I'm good, man, are you? I'm really good. It's Bit nice wet, innit? It's bloody down is what it is. It's nice to have you here, though. Oh, man, it's sick to be here, man. And as a, as a, as a Yorkshire lad, um, a bit of a homecoming. Yeah, flat out, man. It's like I've been coming... Like, I came to this festival, like, twice when I was young. Do you know what I mean? When I just finished my GCSEs and that. Yeah. And, like, like to be playing it this year, just surreal, man. Do you know what I mean? It's amazing. Yeah. I'm like, did you ever, Did you ever think when you came, one day I'm going to be up there? Did you have that moment yeah, where you thought was, that? To be honest, that was kind of, It was weird. I said that to my manager, manager yesterday. I was just like... When I was, like, 15, I was like, that's all I want. And now, like, your dreams change and they get bigger. Yeah, I'm just yeah, like, yeah. what? I did, I did that, man. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, yeah, yeah. I always wanted to be up there, man, of course. Through your music and the stuff that you do online and kind of the art that you produce, you're, you're bringing people together. There's a lot of bringing people totally, together in man. what you do. That's kind of a, that's, that's what it's about, man. I think there's so much division in the world right now. Do you know what I mean? I, yeah. think, there's, I, think, I think that's like a, a real big issue. And to me, man... Yeah, I want to be punk and yeah, I want to be like whatever rock and roll in inverted commas. But my version of it, I don't want to divide people. Yeah, I want to unite them. You know what I mean? Because it's like division's so boring, man. It's been done before. I'm sick of it. Yeah. So I just like make it happy, big one, happy environment, spread and the love. I also, I also think that dividing people is really easy. Bringing people together is tough. Exactly, man. It's like as I say that that's literally it because you have to open yourself up yeah. and like to to it's, it's so much easier to hate something. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's so much easier, no matter what, to sit back and put your guard and be like, that's rubbish, that. whether it be music, whether it be someone, whether it be meeting someone for the first time, you can go, oh, I don't like him. It's so much easier to do that. Totally, yeah. But like, just open your mind, man. Open your bloody mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel Because I feel like you, 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 you're the kind of guy who wants to change the world. I mean, I, I think, to be honest, man, I just like, I'm just saying what I think right now. I think like, what when I was writing the music, man, it was kind of me and my mates initially who were kind of really like, Angry about what with, with, with what is going on? You Where know? did it come from? Did something happen? What? Yeah, it was just it was initially Brexit, man. You know what I mean? Was that it? was, right, that okay. was my first opportunity that I could say what I think. Yeah, yeah. That that my voice could be heard. Do you know what I mean? All my life, I had a lot of energy and was always really opinionated, and people really misunderstood that. Yeah. Um, and it was kind of it was Brexit, and like young people like broke records, turned out in the masses, and mm. we said what we want because, as a generation, man, we are so intelligent. Mm. You know what I mean? We're not just bratty kids rebelling against the system for rebelling against the system's sake. That's it's almost like a naive way of looking at us. Mm. You know what I mean? We 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 are we understand what we want. We know the world we want to be a part of, and we don't get listened to. And it's and it's really frustrating. You know what I mean? And and I just couldn't believe no one was talking about it in pop mu pop popular music. Mm. And. I don't know. I just wanted to. It just made me angry, and it was what was going through my head at the time. And 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 I saw people connecting we to saw it. A picture of you guys. Uh, well, just a few really, but in the studio making some new stuff. Yeah, man. A couple of literally a couple of days ago. Yeah, what, flat can, out. What, I, can, what can you tell us? As I say, on? man. To be honest, like I don't want to be an artist that drops an album, and spends three years getting his next one ready. I've like I've got another album ready to go, and I don't know, man. Like going across the world and meeting people everywhere mm. inspires me that's why i always like after every show even today man i'll hang around for half an hour with the people who came yeah yeah um because man it's like i want to eliminate that boundary between an artist and a and a and a and, a, and an audience because to me man everyone can get quite entitled can't it? it's like yeah, i'm gonna sing my song and then walk off and get him in mercedes van yeah yeah, yeah. and i'm just like i want to talk to you because they inspire me yeah well we can't wait to hear it we're we gonna do a quick uh, interview hook a duck let's do it man good duck of course is like a yorkshire dialect Flat out, Nice these, for, for something nice. So, um, so let's do it. Uh, here right, we go. Young Bloods Flat interview Hook a Duck. Time for Young Bloods Hook a Duck. Um, here we go, my man. Hook that, there, duck. Man. Hook that duck. We've got That's some questions. This is a great idea. Thanks. This is a great idea. Wait, first person, on, day three, the first person to say that. So I appreciate that. Hey. Nailed it. Number, number three, please. Number three. Okay. Question number three is, uh, who is the most famous person in your phone book? <laughs> Probably, yeah. I know it sounds like a name drop, Brooklyn Beckham, good mate of mine. Tell he's me a, all about that, how did that a, come about? He's a good lad, man, I just met him in LA. Do you know what I mean? I, I went, first went out to LA and everyone's quite lardy dar in LA, aren't it? Yeah. Uh, hey man, from LA. Whatever, and I was just like, I met him and I was like, you're, you're sound you, you're British and we just, the thing is man, like, you can't talk to anyone about the football. It's yeah. like, oh man, I, Oh God, the album's great. I'm like, listen, I've been talking about this for three hours. Can we just talk <laughs> about the Doncaster score? <laughs> Is that all right? Do you know what I mean? And then that's it. And like, he was up for that. And he was up for it. <laughs> Proper nice. down to earth, down to earth lad, man, and I love it. 